What's up guys and welcome back to the Chop Shop DLC here in GTA 5. Today we are going to be wrapping up this heist once and for all. So I didn't realize that we weren't quite done with the prep missions. We did three prep missions, kind of like the, the main planning work here. We went and stole the police maverick, we got the tactical gear, and then we disrupted the equipment. But we also have these tasks up here. So we've got to get a getaway vehicle, we've got to get stun guns, we've got to get a weapon stash, and an optional mask mission. I had to steal a ride real quick. Now the good news is I'm not alone. It seems like a lot of people were confused. So shout out to my man Jorg. He left the top comment the last episode. We've got some cops on us. We gotta get out of here. We should be fine though. Just take a little dip down here in the LA River and we should be able to get away no problem. But uh, apparently we need to take a look at the map. There's gonna be green duffel bags. Ah, is this it? Robbery task. That's one out of three. There's a second one up here. And there's a third one all the way up north. All right, we've got a job to do. A lot on our plate, but we're going to get it done. Maybe I've just missed a couple DLCs, but I feel like it wasn't, you know, that obvious that this is what we were supposed to do. Equipment required for the robbery is nearby. We're going to hit up Jamal. What's up, Jamal? I'm outside of the premium deluxe motorsport dealership. Hey. So I got a friend, I guess, over at Ammunition that's gonna set you up with some weapons. Now, we're aiming to do this non-lethal, but once you make it outside the police station, you might need them. Okay, we're gonna go enter the ammunition. Jamal's got us getting our cardio in today. Search ammunition for the unmarked weapons left by Jamal's contact. You got any illegal weapons in here, sir? I don't ever remember ammunition being this this big am i crazy oh they're back here in the range all right we got a dead drop for weapons collect these and stash them at the police station all right definitely don't want to be seen with these they're unmarked can't be traced something hits the fan we're going to be able to defend ourselves we should be good to go i already re-upped on all of our armor and everything i do have to get some p's and q's but we should be all right here. Think of the guns will be safe under the dumpster behind the precinct. Perfect. Yep, good hiding spot. They'll never know. Right under their noses. It's not like a police station has security and could be watching the cameras and seeing a guy on a motorbike pulling up to the back alley and dropping a green duffel bag in their dumpster. Nothing to be sketchy about there. So let's see... Looks like we might have to go around to get to the back sign. Sass weapons and get out of there before they can see you on the cameras. Yep. I mean, that makes sense. Oh. Gate's gonna open for us, all right. You'll raise suspicion if you try to stay too long behind uh, the police station. You'll get a wanted level. All right, let's put it back here. Come on. Come on. Weapons are stashed. Let's get the heck out of here. Please don't leave me in here. Thank you. All right, we're gonna go. Task complete, baby. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so next step. Step number two out of three is going to be up here on the coast. I mean, it's going to be a bit of a ride, but let's go get after it. Those are going to be ready for you when you need them, unless they happen to surprise us with a garbage day, but I swear I checked the schedule. You know, Jamal, I feel like that's kind of a pretty important thing for us to make sure. Uh, a backup plan that typically turns into plan a so we're gonna hope for the best on that one now before we go to the next one actually i bet we're close to the optional one i bet it's the vespucci masks run actually I, th I think he may have left that in the top comment but obviously that's where you buy masks in this game so we do have four tasks one of which is optional i'm gonna see if this is where we're supposed to be going Sorry, guys. Sorry. Yep. I remember. Dude, I haven't been back here in a long time. The thing is, in real life, this is actually like a, a crazy hat story. What up, Louie? How you been, bro? I miss you. Hopefully, you come back for GTA 6. So, I know a guy who knows a guy at the mask shop in Vespucci. Thought the connect would come in handy for a party or something, but this is way better. Grab one if you're nearby. So, these are the masks for the gangbanger robber. We've got animal face, hooded ski, loose balaclava, neck gaiters, all kind of tech mask set, warrior sets. <laughs> They'll never see it coming. Time to ride up the coast. Let's go get uh, the next step complete. That's two out of four. Been a minute since I've been on the pier, dude. Oh my goodness. 
There's so many iconic locations around this map that I have spent so much time on and thinking about how we're going to learn new ones and create new ones and new memories and everything is, is kind of crazy, dude. GTA 6 cannot come soon enough, but it's also a little overwhelming thinking about just how much we're going to have to explore and learn and discover and things it's it's gonna be great when you think about what gta 5 was like the first like few months how all of us were just going up this road over to the the military base to ramp the car up the side over the fence to be able to grab a jet and that was like the coolest thing that everybody did think about that but where we are today and think about how that game is gonna grow and explode and change over time like this one has Woo. Almost bypassed it on our uh, our little reminiscing there. Gonna hit up Jamal again. Let's see what we got going on. Your boy looks fresh. I love this. We got the Steve Maddens on, the blue jacket, the pink so Burberry I'm mask. I'm thinking we'll use stun guns to take care of any cops you run into. Now, we're not there to shoot up a whole precinct, and we don't want anyone to shoot my guy during the escape. I got a tip on a security guards who should have some stun guns in their car. I got the license plate here for you. Search the parking lot for the security vehicle, all right? I mean, this is the only vehicle here. 21C MM287, stun guns are in that one. 62J OI578. No, nope, that's it. It's actually in the parking lot down the street. Sorry, it's the yellow the yellow thing over here. All right, makes sense. We were having a little meeting off on the side where nobody could see us. But now we're going to pull in. All right, two. I mean, is it the patrol vehicle? Come on. The, the only one that says it's patrol? Open the trunk. Hopefully this doesn't bring the attention of anybody. We're going to steal the stun guns. Got them. All right, let's go deliver them to the salvage yard. Get out of here before anybody suspects anything. Just gonna wall right out of here. We're getting shot at. Probably could have had something that wasn't a bike, if you want me to be honest. I think our only chance of surviving is gonna be to go up and over. There's no way. They're they're gonna they're gonna catch us otherwise. Holy cow. Just gonna go all the way up top to the parking lot up here. Is this the oh, this is the yeah, sick, right? Thanks, boys. All right, bit of a long way home, but we should be good to go. Hopefully not going to run into anybody else. We're looking a little light. I don't want to apply any armor or anything until we're we're ready to take on the heist, so. Trying to keep it chill till then. Quite literally raised on these streets, though, man. It's, so it's just such a beautiful game, and I, I still, I, I feel like 10 years later... Obviously traveled on these streets before, but everything still feels so so new. Maybe it's because I haven't really played in the last couple years, but I don't know. It just it feels so good to be back on this. You guys were making me feel so good reading the comments on that last video. How it, you know, brought you back and seeing the character with the blue jacket and, and just all the memories we've had on this game together, dude. It it was something special. I just I can't I can't wait for it to happen again. I feel like the, the hype has died down a little bit, obviously, since the trailer's been out for a while. We don't have anything new. There's, uh... If you look at when the first GTA 5 trailer came out versus the second one, I mean, it's like a year difference. So I really hope we aren't waiting a year for the next one, but we could be. Let me go double check. I want to make sure we have... There were so many masks, it's kind of hard to tell which ones are approved for this mission. Let's see if we have... The optional objective taken care of. Yep, we did. Last but not least, we've got our getaway vehicle. Talking about throwbacks, this is going to bring us back here. This Hello, is... you're through to Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help? Talking about throwbacks, this is going to bring us Great. back. Hey, yo, the Pegasus. Is waiting for you at our nearest airfield. We Grab me a, uh, a Luxor. Why did it put it... That's not where it's supposed to go, is it? We're going to find out. It's been a while since I called. I wanted to do the little little jump into the airport and grab our Luxor and fly over to the other side of the map since we're going so far just to kind of mix it up a little bit. Maybe I've lost my marbles. Do we go in? I, I was... I guess we can go in over here and it, it sets up the plane 
right there. This does not seem right. I was thinking of this. I remember when we used to come around this way and ramp up the, uh, the little dumpster pile over here. And then it would spawn in the, the hangar right here. Whose is this? And if it's not anybody's, can I take it? Why not? Let me just park the bike right in front of the wing because we, you know, we'll, we'll just hit that on the way out. It's not a big deal. So this is not my luck, sir, but I'll, I'll take it. Uh, under the wing. Not too shabby. So we're going to take off with this bad boy. Wheels up, 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 and away we go. Oh, dude. Oh, so many fond memories. All right, we are going all the way up to the northwest side of the island. It's going to be a uh, five-minute flight. Don't you worry about it, folks. Captain T. Martin's got it under control, and uh, we'll see you when we see you. Bro, are you kidding me? Look at this. I don't think I've flown a Luxor in first person. This is making me want to play some more MS Flight Sim. Hopefully you guys are cool with that. I'm thinking about bringing it back on the channel. Honestly, it's it's a little bit concerning. We've got a lot of House Flipper. I recorded like four episodes of House Flipper today. So those are going to start up soon. Um, I was looking at release dates and stuff. I mean, we always go through this at the end of every year. But like, I, I feel like this year is extra bad. There's just nothing that's mega. I'm going to mark this so we can get our heading right. But yeah, there, there's just like... I mean, House Flipper, I'm personally really excited for. I hope it does well on the channel. But there's nothing really there's uh, the prince of persia game but it's a side scroller comes out in january um suicide squad kill the justice league comes out in february which that looks pretty good but i don't know if i'm gonna be home when that releases it, it's it's a pretty light start to the year which it's always light but i feel like this one's extra light so it's gonna be interesting to see what we play we're just gonna have to get creative with it we're gonna have to have some fun with it we're gonna play some simulators and hop on old school stuff like this I always think about going back and playing, like, old games, like old Uncharted's and stuff, so might check that out. I know I missed Jedi Survivor. I'm thinking about going back and playing that in Horizon Forbidden West. But, yeah, it's going to be a, uh, a bit of a slow season for the rest of the year, the start of next year. Mount Chiliad, you big behemoth. I remember climbing you, like, once or twice in ten years and never touched you again. You're cool. You're nice to look at, but you're just not... All that fun. All right. Your boy's out. Hopefully we get a parachute. We do. That's good to hear. Just going to take this nice free fall. Sorry about it. Luxor. What is that? Like a $10 million jet, I'm pretty sure. Is what we paid for it before. That thing's going down. She's falling way faster than we are. Because she's got thrust, doesn't she? All right. Go ahead and pull the chute. We're going to land pretty much directly on top of our target. Now, the thing is, we probably want to grab... Oh... We got the Pope's on us. I'm gonna land up on the rooftop here. So they can't see us, break our legs, no big deal. Just hide, just hide. If they see us up here, I'm gonna be really upset. There's no way, right? Stay down. Oh, come on! <laughs> Let me face plant off the top. Bro, when's the last time you were in a foot chase on GTA 5? Like, come on, Trev. You're. You're better than this. We got a payphone going off. I need a I need a vehicle. I need a vehicle real, real quick. You guys are really that upset that I I ghost rode the jet. Is it that big of a deal? We got two stars now. We're in whatever the heck this thing is. This is not going to plan. I should have sent her off into the ocean. If we did that, we would have been fine. It's okay. We're just gonna go off onto the beach over here. I'm sure we're gonna be able to get away and hopefully they won't bother us again. I don't even know if I've touched this side of the map, bro. Where where are we? What is this? Off-road trails? Like I said, 10 years later, still discovering new stuff. I don't think I've ever been out here. I don't even know if they'll come out here. I doubt they do. I'm going to keep going to the water just to be safe. Oh, or not. And our FJ Cruiser looking thing here, and we're... We're just going to chill and watch the moon rise. Now, I know we're getting a getaway vehicle here, but just in case we need to chase it down or something, I'm going to get us in something a little bit quicker. Probably going to end up leaving our Nero out here in the middle of BF nowhere, but that's, that's all right. So let's go pull up to this last little prep point. 
And then it's going to be time for us to get this thing popping. Alright. Let's give him a call. I heard about the carjacking ring based out of a shitty auto shop. Now they have a bunch of stolen armored cars there. And I'm sure if you did a little browsing, you'll find a solid getaway vehicle. Fair warning though, these guys aren't going to let it go without a fight. Okay. So we're going to want to break into the garage. I guess, uh, I don't know why our, our assault rifle doesn't have any ammo, because I swear I bought a bunch of ammo. So we're just going to grab something else. We have this. Let's also, I didn't know you could use armor in this screen and also eat snacks in this screen. That completely changes the game. That was one of my least favorite things about this. So that's something I should have known a long time ago. I don't know when that was added, but that's a little embarrassing. So we're going to break in here. And let's hope for the best. <laughs> Did the, the pink balaclava something. Steal the getaway vehicle. Fuck you. What the? <laughs> Bro, are you kidding? It really... It really spawned us in like that? I'm getting absolutely shredded here, bro. There's there's not a whole lot I can do. I'm going through all of our armor. She's dead. Guy's back there. He's dead. I wasn't sure who was going to have a gun, who I was supposed to shoot. I didn't want to shoot any civvies or anything. He's dead. There's one behind us? Well, bro, you could have killed me 15 times over, and there's one right here. All right, everyone's down. My goodness, that was ridiculous. So we're going to be taking this this bad boy back here. Oh, uh, we could pick anything we want. So we've got a, uh, a Z-looking thing all armored up. We've got a little two-door off-roader. I don't know what kind of driving we're going to be doing. We've got the, the big boss hog in the back. We've got the charger. Or we've got the, the Range Rover. I'm tempted by the Boss Hog, but I also feel like the Charger could be kind of sick. Let's take this bad boy. Get our, our Franklin on. See ya! <laughs> Alright, now I'm assuming we're going to be chased here. And we're going to want to get out of here before they can... Destroy our car or anything. Let's just run 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 like the wind. It's gone in 60 seconds. Your boy is outie. So this is the police station right here. I'm thinking Is that up top or is that across the street? Where do we want the stash spot to be? Maybe he was putting his Chinese order in maybe in here. I feel like this one's pretty close so we can just Throw her right like that. All right. Mission complete. We'll take it. We can collect the getaway vehicle from the chosen location and use it to escape the cops when we're ready. Let's go ahead and hotwire a car while we're stashing it. No big deal. Yeah, it makes sense. Let's, let's draw even more attention to ourselves. But we're going to go. We need to go buy some more P's and Q's and armor, obviously. My goodness, we got torched. Trying to steal that thing. And there we go. Take a look at our computer. I think we're ready for the heist, bro. Hope we're going to be able to do this on our own. We'll see. I don't know. Sometimes right. these can be crazy. We're and we're doing this. We're raiding a police station full of cops <laughs> to rescue a repeat offender to steal a car from an armed gang. Woo. That's what we're doing. Okay. Seems like a great idea. So let's go ahead and start the robbery. Oh boy. This is gonna be something. Good okay, looking outfit. You ready for this crazy shit? Now pick up the police chopper and start making your way over to Mission Row. I'll call you in a bit once I've done some breathing exercises. <laughs> Alright, so a third of a mile away, we're gonna go pick up a little police chopper that we stole earlier in the week from a uh Vaccine. 
How do we get up to the top of this building is the question. Seems like a simple enough plan. I'll get ready for this car, boss, because it's going to be a killer. Now, my guy's got a good eye, you know. Hey, He's not doing shit that lands him in jail that is. What am I supposed to do? Ah, we got some stairs on the backside here. All right, perfect. Well, just another day in the office. Your boy's got a lot to do. Oh, I forget. I forget where the office is. I'm trying to get up to the police maverick. It's up on top of this building and there's no way up there. There's got to be a ladder somewhere or something. Yep, yeah, right here. Yep, yeah, sorry about that, boss. Uh, it's been a minute. So we're just going to mosey our way up top. Good thing we're police. We could park our choppers wherever we want. Just put it right on top of this building. And here we go. So we have stun guns. We deleted half of the equipment that they had. They're still going to have equipment, just not as much. It seems like we've got a fairly easy entry okay, with the Maverick. Sounds good to me. Not a problem at all. Just going to bring her in nice and slowly. Just your boy, just another day in the neighborhood. There it is. Nice landing, bro. Now, incapacitate any cops up there so you can keep going. Remember, you've got the key card to get you through the roof entrance. All right, let's roll out what did the I next just throw? phase. Gassing the guards so we don't have to shoot anyone. Throw some of those gas grenades through the air vents. Okay, we've got air vents around. I did not mean to... To throw the first one, I just kind of panicked. I'm not going to lie. How do we get up top of these? Oh, there you go. Okay. There's one. This one's got a nice electrical box we can jump up on. There's two. I don't see that this is... That one... Okay, that one went down. The other ones did not go down. So we... We missed the other ones. How do I... That one went down. This one they could have made a little bit easier to get to. This one. That one went down this time. See, last time it kind of looked like it went down too, but I guess not. So that's three out of four. We got one more over on this side. Let's go down to the range later and fire off a few rounds. I think we can hear cops below us talking. That one went down. We've got a bunch of activity here. How do I get back up top? Come on, come on. Oh, God. Dude, what the fudge? How do you want me to get back up top? I can't get up top. There's a ladder here. Come on. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Before they bring the choppers out and you start getting shot at. All right. I have a stun gun. That was not very fast or efficient. Okay, we're going to the first floor. We're just going to stun a bunch of cops here. No big deal. We didn't get everyone, but we got quite a few of them. In the locker rooms, he's down. Okay. Let's try to hurry this up. We got to go through this door here. Hold on a second. Alright, got my armor back up. He's down. He's down. He's down. Got this guy back here. We got the cell keys. Okay. Trying to work as quickly as possible. Grab these. Kill you. I'm hearing more people. Your hands on those keys. Get them over to my boy's cell. He should be on the lowest level, aka the basement. The gas won't have made it down there yet, so be ready. Keep it non-lethal. The basement's back this way, where we killed this last guy. All right. Dead? Uh. 
trying to be smart about this. I don't see anybody. Do you guys see anybody? Access the computer to unlock the security doors. Okay. Well, this is a a little bit concerning. Got our our guitar hero on here. Our dance dance revolution. We got it. All right. Use the keys to open King Tiny's cell. Looks like we might not have anybody else hey, in here. He's here. getting ripped. Me, you, you here for me? Oh shit! Hey, get me out of here. Okay. The back door is the quickest way out of here. I've been memorizing the code. Everybody punches into that lock. Let's hit it. I got a chopper waiting nearby. Yo, those sirens are everywhere. Make sure you pick up your weapons once you get outside, just in case. Oh, oh yeah, did I mention that King Tiny has a chopper? <laughs> Podcast must be doing pretty good, right? That's how he's getting out of town. You just got to get him to it. Okay. So we want to grab our guns at the exit. Nobody here? Let me grab my guns. Collect the stashed weapons. And now we want to get King Tiny the heck out of here. Destroy the panel. What the fudge, dude? Those guys are both dead. I mean... I say we hop in this. Let's just go. Let's just go. Let's get the fudge out of here. Skirt! I'm not gonna worry about the, the buffalo if we can just get get gone. Holy shit. Down the drain, we're out. Get away from the choppers, let's just go, baby. We got four stars on us right now, that is not good. I'm gonna try to get away from the guys up top there. I mean, this was the best case scenario for, for a getaway location. Down into the LA River. Just gonna chill right here. Can we turn our lights off? Oh boy. I think we might have done it. Oh, that was so lit, dude. I love these so much. Imagine the heist we're gonna have in the next game. So going... Oh shit. Is that cock coming this way? Are you freaking kidding me, bro? He found us down here? Really? Oh, uh, Lester, can you help? Can I call Lester, please? Somebody help me out here. Bro, what the fudge? I don't I don't know what to do then. I really don't. I felt like the the river was our way out. I still feel like it is. I think we I think we go back to the right and try to get back there. Oh, fudge. Your boy counted his chickens before they hatched. Get me back down here. Sorry. I don't know what to say, dude. I'm I'm upset. I thought we freaking had it. As soon as they come down here, we'll kill them. We'll grab a different car. All right. Don't you worry about it. Bro, did I really have to crash the freaking car? I'm so mad. I'm so mad. We're gonna be fine. Got him. Hop in, bro. We gotta go. We're out. Don't flip it this time, Trev. That's the biggest thing you can do is don't flip the damn thing. I thought we were done. I thought we were clear. I didn't think somebody was going to come down here. There's the SWAT team. I'm just going to fly. I'm just going to go. I'm not going to stop going. I'm going to keep going until they can't find us anymore. We're just going to ride off into the sunset together, bro. Does it get too deep here? I don't, I don't think I've done this in a while. It gets too deep here. We're fine. Just hide here, bro. Get out. You can swim, right? I hope. We're good. Get up here and hide. What the fudge, bro? I I just quit. I'm done. I, I quit. I don't... I haven't played GTA in so long. I don't know what to do anymore, dude. I don't know how to get away from this. We're dying here. 
I'm sorry, guys. I let you down. If you're looking to get bailed out of jail, don't call my ass, because I, I won't get you out. I'll get you caught. I'll get you an extra however many years on your bid. The problem is they're just going to infinitely come this way, so we got to push at least a little bit. Get in here, Tiny. Let's go. Come on. Get in the freaking car, bro. Thank you. I don't know where to go. It seems like there's only one way out of here, so we're going to have to go back the way we came. Bro, I haven't played in so long. I don't know where, like, the tunnels and stuff are. Just going to juke them out. I'm going to try to get out on the, uh, the highways and, and try to go... F oh, fudge. Get in this one, bro. They popped our tire. Hey, Siri, how do you get away from a five-star GTA thing? Where's, like, the guaranteed tunnels that you can go into and stuff? I know there's easier ways to get out of this. Bro, what the fudge? The freaking civilians are helping them out. I can't lose this, man. It's got to be the river. I'm going all in on the river, bro. We got we to gotta get away down there. Don't flip it. Oh, my God, bro. Keep going, please. Oh, I'm gonna f***ing cry, bro. Uh, I don't know what to do. Get in here. We're gonna die. We're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die. King, where are you going, bruv? Get me out of here! In the freaking whatever the hell this thing is, please, for the love of God, let me get away. If anything can freaking work, just go get under a bridge and stay there, Trev. They're not going to search this far down, right? The choppers are not going to search this far down. After we were all the way back over there, we're under this thing. Let's make sure we're fully under it. Please, 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 please. Oh my God, they passed us. I could vomit. Oh my god, there's somebody coming down. Should we move forward? Probably, but I'm not gonna risk it. Go away, please, 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 please. This cop's gonna find us. He's gonna find us. Oh my god, bro, I can't. It's my own fault. I just, I haven't played GTA in so long. We should have got away on the first one, and I, now that we didn't, I screwed it up. Where are like the little tunnels? I know there's those tunnels that you can go into that they never check. If you go, like, deep, is that one right there? I don't think this is the one I was thinking of. Definitely not the one I was thinking of, but it leads them on a, a bit of a wild goose chase while we try to get away. I'm at a loss. There's, there's so many guys. It's not the train tunnel, is it? No. I don't think we're going to be able to use that. Oh, maybe this train tunnel over here. Come on. This is an old school one. Please. Freaking tell me nobody follows me in here. We just got to be careful in case the train comes. <laughs> the world's worst GTA police chase and we got it done we had no armor left I thought we were out of cars bro I'm sorry that was trash I hope you guys enjoyed an absolute scrub take King Tiny to LSIA I I cannot believe that just happened. Watch us die to the train here, dude. I'd cry. I cannot believe that just happened. That, I, that was sweaty fingers. That was everything that GTA used to be. If we're talking about being, you know, throwbacks and, and reminiscing and things like that, like imagine back in the day when you got your first five star and you were trying to figure out how in the heck you were supposed to get away and you barely got out. That was us right there. It definitely shouldn't have happened 10 years later, but I guess it is what it is. So I'll take the purple... 
thing off there. I can't believe that just happened. I thought we were going to have to redo it. I didn't know how much of it we were going to have to reset up for the heist. Obviously, I don't think we would have had to do anything specific, but we definitely would have had to buy more armor and P's and Q's and everything else. Dude, that was a freaking game and a half. Bro, we were at half health. I think we've got some snacks left, but we definitely had no more armor. And we got that done. Holy cow. I'm just like, I'm trying not, not to hit anything. Imagine we run into a car or something, get ejected and die here. Some random event happens. Bro, King Tiny, I'm going to be honest. You had me on pins and needles there for a second. You were taking a leisurely stroll when we were trying to use the final slow getaway vehicle. And you, you had me a little bit nervous there, bro, but... It all worked out. You gonna open this up for me? Bro, did we... We don't bust through, do we? I... I don't want another police chase on my hand. I, I thought we were gonna have security on us or something right there. But it looks like we're gonna drive him right up to his helo. And that boy is out. Now, what are we going to have to do to, to steal the nice car? We fucking did it. I'm out of there. Woo. <laughs> hey, I got a split. But here's where you find the car. He's just going to give us a locate. Oh, uh, infiltrate the Bala's hideout. Are you freaking kidding me? We're going to have to go fight some Bala's for it. Quick pit stop to buy some armor here. We're going to double check. We have snacks and stuff going into Bala's territory to steal one of their vehicles. On top of that, we're dressed as a cop. Seems like a really bad idea. So let's, yeah, we have no, no body armor available. We should have plenty of snacks though. I've got ego chasers and P's and Q's and all of the above. Oh, we can't. Are you freaking kidding me? We can't buy more armor. We may not get this car, fellas. I I'm going to be honest with you. I uh, I don't like that one bit. I, we're, we're, I'm going to try my best. We're going to try to play it safe. It kind of depends on where it spawns us in and what it has us doing. But that feels very bad. Hey, we got the Iceman out of here. But it's King Tiny, I guess his name was. He, he wasn't King Ice. He was King Tiny. Um... We got him out of here. I'm going to consider that a, a job well done. If we don't get this car, we don't get this car. It just is what it is. Thing is just limping up the streets of Los Santos. We are almost there. I mean, the ballas are hanging out up in the hills. All right, I, I see them. They're doing all right then. I'm just curious. I mean, is there anything we can do? I don't think there's anything we can do. We just got to eat as many snacks as we can. I don't know if maybe we get up on the hill. I'm going to do that. Work smarter, not harder. Let's see if we can snipe down on them. Use like an explosive sniper or something. And maybe just maybe get the advantage. Although we might fall down. The oh, we don't have anything explosive, bro. What? I don't want to end up falling down the, the hill, though, is the problem. I guess we could get in our car. We don't have any of our equipment. There's no explosives. We can't get any more any more armors. Like I, I feel like we're at a pretty serious disadvantage here. So we're gonna We're gonna shoot at them. We're gonna kill most of them and then we're gonna hop in our car and run down and, and hopefully steal it. We'll see. Bro, they don't even know we're here yet. I mean, we took out a few. That's a few that we won't have to worry about once we're in there. I really wish we could have rained down some explosive bullets from up here. Oh, my God. Please don't run into my car. Thank you. Dead? We got it! I think. No freaking way, dude! Deliver it back to the salvage yard. We got him after us, but we're gonna be fine. Just just run away. Just run away. You are. Bro. 
Way faster, way smarter than them. Just gonna send it. Not gonna wait. Please tell me there's nobody. Oh, bro, I swear. How did that thing grip that well, bro? That was. <laughs> did you see how quickly that regain control? This thing is insane. Could you, can you buy this? I'm not sure. Dude, the the handling of this is outrageous. By far the the stickiest car that I've seen yet. So we we chose the most expensive one, of course. So I guess that makes sense. Holy cow, I was not ready to fight another gang after everything we've been through, but we actually got out there and got it done. Tell me we don't have to actually leave them. Please pull into the garage. Please be done. Holy cow. Sweaty palms the entire time, but we got it done, baby. Your boy still got it. Dude, I'm out of practice with GTA, that's for sure. Okay, now you drink, yes? Now that we've made some money. Of course, of course. Of course. Down the hatch. It's good shit, huh? It's very exclusive. It's very hard to find. Just like something else, huh? Oh, you, you are a genius. Look at it. It's beautiful. I want to keep it, though. I don't want to sell it. DJing in just to see. Jamal, be excited. Uh, hell yeah. This shit is lit, cuz. Your boss is in a class of their okay. own. Take a picture of me with it. Come, come, come on. Huh? Yes, yes. Uh, nice. Oh, yes, the tequila. Yes. <laughs> oh, my God, this is the real baller shit. <laughs> These are lit, cuz. So, what are you going to do with it, huh? Is this one for me? I have the money with me. <laughs> no, don't tell me I don't want to know. I'll go back to Liberty and either this magnificent beast will follow shortly after, or you'll send me an even better one. Should such a thing even exist. <laughs> Come on, Jamal. Shit, come on. Bro. You will lie, let's shit, roll. shit, shit. Yeah, I'm ah, keeping this bro. one. Sorry, Woo. fellas. Definitely gonna be adding that to our stable. Robbery complete. The gangbanger robbery. No cop lives lost. Jailbreak in three minutes. King Tiny has 75% health. We did get all challenges no, completed. We, we did not. We could, but right? um all right, that was absolutely insane. I love how he's he's posing with it. So, hope you guys enjoyed. We got it done. My goodness. That was honestly really, really good. I really enjoyed that. I definitely want to check out some more uh, of this game. I know there were a bunch of new vehicles added. We used to do the, the videos where we would buy a vehicle and customize it and stuff. I also know that there's drift racing now, which I haven't checked out yet. Apparently, it's actually pretty good. So, we'll probably check that out in some future videos. I mean, GTA is back. I don't know how long we're going to be chilling with GTA in the channel, but I'm really enjoying it so far. So if you guys are too, let me know. Drop a like, and I'll see you guys in the next one.